what unit do we have here? HMV 105. So it has the, is this an E1 control on the back here? Now how come on this one, the control looks like, it's just this one solenoid in here, it's not a whole lot. On the pump it's on the outside, so you can have your two solenoids, or you can have your hydraulic ports, or your mechanical to drive it from A side to B side. On this one, you don't need to have it to go from A side to B side. They could do it with, they got a solenoid, and then they got a valve with another valve inside. So they can use it all internally in the back end. And all, and all a hydraulic motor does is it turns hydraulic power into this mechanical rotary power. Now with this control then, though, it still needs to go both sides of center, right? Correct. So it's still capable of doing it, but it just maybe doesn't have some of the other adjustments and so forth that are on it. Yeah, it's just, just okay. milliamps, sends it one way, sends it the other way. Because really this is more just receiving pressure. Yeah, because you got your pump that's driving it. You got your pump being pushed to the one way. It's going to go from min to max. Mm -hmm. So you're telling it which way to go by supplying the oil to That's it. right. So the, the, the controls is just, it's not necessary to have the controls on the motor because it's just receiving what the pump is giving it anyways. Yep. It just, it's just yep. the terms of displacement.